I have the great honour of working with some truly amazing CEOs. I'm working with a CEO at the moment. I've been working with him for about 18 months. And I've learned this very much from him. And that's this concept of any time you hear about a problem in your business, in your organisation, instead of burying your head in the sand about it or hoping it will sort itself out, you run as fast as you possibly can at that problem. And so you're constantly on guard or listening out for the signals of something going a bit wobbly somewhere. Somebody not being sure about something, somebody not going in quite, quite in the right direction. And you go straight towards that. You run at it as fast as you possibly can. And the benefits of this obviously are that you're hitting that problem early so it doesn't get worse and worse and worse over time. It diverges out. You've got a strong case for bringing that person back into line to helping them understand what's going on. You're running towards a problem to solve it quickly so the secondary effects of that problem are not compounded across the organisation. So running quickly at something means that you get that, you get to the nub of it, you get there quickly before it escalates into something worse. And the side benefit of that obviously is then you don't, it's unlike, you're unlikely to uncover as many larger problems later on. That problem where you've sort of buried your head in the sand because this person isn't doing particularly well or doesn't seem to get what's going on or understand where you need to be. Somebody's not performing at a particular level. You think, oh, it'll be OK, we'll deal with that at the next annual review. All of that stuff means that the longer you leave something, the worse that problem can get and the harder it is to correct once it's there. So my biggest recommendation to you is this you start listening for problems and running at them as fast as you can, attacking them as soon as you hear about those particular problems. Future you will thank you for it. Current you will feel a little bit icky about doing it at first. But again, all of these things and all of these behaviours you, you have to learn as a CEO are all like muscles. You need to strengthen that muscle up. Right. And running and problem solving muscle is something that you need to strengthen up. That, that getting over that feeling of awkwardness and just getting straight to the problem very very quickly the more you do it the less of that icky feeling will be there anyway and it'll become a natural behavior for you and equally as well what's also interesting about that as soon as you start doing that you start to lead by example and you see other people in your organization doing exactly the same thing so again run as fast as you can towards the problem and you'll thank me for it later